There's been a real trend in the last 50 years to think about people and nature as completely separate. So people are almost, you know, in spite of nature. You know, for us at Isle of Fire, we realized if our goal is to have a world full of living buildings and communities, that we need to shift that way of thinking fundamentally. And we need to really repair and restore this relationship between people and nature that looks at our relationship as if people are part of nature. The Bullet Center is really pretty remarkable. It's hard to understand until you visit it exactly why it's as remarkable as it is. It's like this, as Dennis Hayes would say, a tree popping up in the middle of a reasonably bleak, concrete, urban environment that demonstrates not only what buildings could be, but also what an architecture for Seattle and for this place and climate should really look like. That's a pretty unique approach for an urban building, and I think the Bullet Center, for that reason, sets an example of the types of projects and buildings that we should be creating in our cities that can allow both us to be connected to nature, but also us to be connected to each other.